Now let's see if we can make it feel like summer. Take the top spot this summer with this luscious lemon tiramisu. We've never made it on the show before. You can make a big version, but today we have opted for individual glasses because Max and I are all about those individual servings. Perfect for entertaining this festive season. I love lemons. I love lemony anything. I haven't loved tiramisu because I, I don't enjoy coffee outside of a coffee cup for some reason. This is like the perfect marriage for me. This is totally. amazing. Totally. This is such a quick, easy dessert to whip up, as you said, in very cute individual portions, which I think is so cute for dinner parties. Oh, this for season. sure. So can you get cutting those lemons for I me, can, please? with absolute pleasure. We are going to juice three lemons into just a bit of water over here. Okay. A little top tip is yes, there sieve we go. through okay. so that we don't get too many seeds in there. Ooh. On this end, we're going to get a little bit noisy. So we Do have it. a little bit of Nestle whipping cream, which we have chilled in the fridge so that it actually whips up nice and strongly. Ooh, and lovely. I'm going to oh. get this guy going. You know what? I have a little kitchen fairy oh, that has brought magic. me something magical. Magic. Lovely. Okay, I'm... There we oh, go. Come to me. Oh. Okay, so we'll I don't think that I'm normally not allowed to even use these things. But that is awesome. <laughs> Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Um, and when you're using the whipping cream, I understand that there is a nuance here, okay? And this is a very special one. It gives your favorite sweets and savory dishes on either side of that spectrum the love they've been longing for with Nestle's whipping cream. It's perfect for dessert toppings, for baking, for cooking. Um, it really is the perfect additive to take this to next level, I think. 100%. Yeah, let's get some more going here. So I'm going to add two tablespoons of icing sugar in here as well. So okay. this is really, you said you don't love the coffee element of tiramisu. Yeah. So we are making a lemon syrup today instead, which I think is such a fun play on it. Also oh, fresh for so summer. So clever. So we have some water, lemon juice, icing sugar. You're going to give that a mix when you're done. And cool. it's going to become our little base to soak our ladies. It's going to kind of bind everything together. Over here, I've got some cottage cheese, which I actually really like the addition of this. Also just to yeah. kind of thicken up the mousse element and make it hold a bit firmer. For sure. Oh. And we know, <laughs> speaking of firm, it's holding, man. Um, and it's, I think, lemon and cheese just rock together in this way. When it's a cream cheese lemon combo, it's just, it adds kind of an extra um, flavor element. Yeah, but it's the texture of it. It's just going to be spectacular. And yeah, that's Thick, just that tang as wonderful. well. So okay. I'm going to add also a little bit of icing sugar to my cream cheese over here. Oh, the lemons are singing. Are you almost, are you there? Almost, almost, almost there. Almost there? Okay, beautiful. Oh, we've got maximum lemon here okay so just giving this a quick beat and then i'm actually going to combine the whipping cream oh. with this cottage cheese oh the lemon is how's that contraption working it's for you? absolutely amazing <laughs> i hope they let me use it again um no it's really done the job here absolutely beautiful i'm gonna mix these guys together and we've got our lemon syrup okay I love this because it's fresh it's not too heavy you know we do so much heavy eating this is taking a dessert that can be a lot, and we've kind of lightened it and softened it just a little bit. So I love this. And the combination is going to be amazing. Smelling so amazing as well. Yeah. So here yeah, we're combining our cottage cheese with our whipping cream, because this is what we're going to layer between mm. our finger biscuits. Over there, can you please put a little bit of that into this bowl? Okay. And then you're going to get soaking. So oh, cool. we are going to pop okay. our... That's enough, that's enough. Okay. We're going to pop them in. All right. I think that's even a bit too much. I'm going to put in a little bit less, just okay. so that they don't float. So you Beautiful. just want to get... Just like that, one side, and then and we're going to turn it, it over. over. Boom. Okay. And not too long, because these... They absorb get... really, really yes. well, yeah. So we're going to actually put a biscuit layer on the bottom over here. Boom. You can hold okay. up a little layer. Okay. Just make sure, is it soaked? Yeah, I think it's soaked a little bit further. Maybe turn it over. There we go. Oh, lovely. I'm going to combine our cream. Ooh -hoo. Boom, boom, boom. And this is one of those things, if you want to get the kids involved, if you want to make it a family affair... It's so fun. It really is. It's such a fun way to get the family involved. Because I think the problem is when you're cooking for a big day like this, then whoever is doing the chefy duties disappears. Exactly. And kind of unplugs from the... I might have overdone our base layer a little bit. You know what? We love, we love the lemony element that those Abundance are going to Abundance is what this Christmas is about. Okay, so here we go. Mm. We can, you can keep soaking while I... 
get some of our moussey layer in. Oh, and I mean, if you amazing. could smell the lemon here, absolutely amazing. If you want to get your hands on this recipe, all your guts to do is go to expressoshow.com. Um, and if you want some more inspiration for the festive season, go to recipeswithlove.co.za. Some absolute gems in there. Boom. Oh, you know what man. else is amazing about this as well is you can make it in advance and then you pop it in the fridge and when the guests come it's all done. So oh, and it's only I would imagine these are the kind of flavors that are only going to develop and get better. It looks spectacular. The lemon zing is just exploding out of this dish. Absolutely wonderful. So let's add a little more zing to this and give you the chance to win and win big. So you stand a chance to win inverters, canister stoves and Nestle hampers. So you can literally keep cooking for the entire festive season, no excuses. So you've got to enter the whip, whisk and win competition to get yourself there. And all you have to do is buy any two participating Nestle dairy culinary products. We've given you a couple and how you can use them. And then you dial star 120 star 440 hash and then simply follow the prompts and all the terms and conditions apply. This is honestly one of the most simple but awesome dessert recipes we've done on the show. Give me a yes, lemony high so five. Cute. Absolutely amazing. Expressoshow.com. Go and try it for yourself. That's Stand it. a chance to win in the Whip, Whisk and Win promotion by using Nestle Dairy Culinary Products. Buy any two participating products, dial star 120 star 440 hash and follow the prompts to enter. T's and C's apply.